Striking doctors presented a petition seeking Parliament's introduction of measures that would ensure the healthcare sector is improved to the standards they would prefer. However, the Senate's Health Committee has one requirement that they feel is derailing the road to recovery. The CBA was ruled by the courts to be an illegitimate document. So the the doctors may not have local standard to overbase their demands on that document. The committee feels that while parties fight to have their way, Kenyans continue to suffer. I'm wondering when we say that the, the number of people registering as, as voters is not being achieved, how can somebody go to register as a, a voter when the family is sick? when the family is on an, sto uh, an empty stomach, when that family, the son or the daughter, whom they educated to become a doctor, they sold one piece of land they, they have to make sure that this son or this daughter become a doctor and can support the, uh, the, the family. The Senate now wants the presidency to intervene once more and they have implored upon the courts not to make a ruling that would send doctors to jail. Even as the legislature and the judiciary are called upon to make a fair ruling, the Court of Appeal has rejected calls to grant temporary orders to avoid a one-month jail term for KMPDU officials. Dr. Wilfred Mashage, the chairman of the Health Committee of the Senate, insists that the CBA that was signed in 2013 is indeed illegal. However, he says he is willing to mediate to come to an amicable solution for the problem. He now proposes a joint committee of both houses of parliament that will arbitrate the matter. Leila Mohamed, NTV.